Greetings. Today, we will address the issue of disabled run or debug options in Visual Studio. Due to this error, you can't run or debug your project. Close Visual Studio, delete files from the bin, VS, OBJ, and temp folders, and then relaunch Visual Studio. Clean and rebuild your solution. Make sure that all the projects in the solution are loaded. Sometimes, the problem occurs due to the missing or updated project's reference in the solution file. Unload the projects and build the solution. Reload the project and rebuild the solution. Set the single startup project for the solution. Ensure that the correct configurations and platforms are set for the solution. Usually, the solutions are opened directly from the folder location on the drive. It might be helpful to open the solution from within the Visual Studio. If a project is shared among multiple programmers, Ensure that the VS folder is also included in the source control. Review the project's references. Add missing references or correct existing ones. Add the paths of .NET folders to the system environment variable. Copy the SDK folder from the 64-bit.NET folder. Paste it to the 32-bit folder in Program Files. Create a new project and transfer your code to isolate the issue. If the problem persists, modify the Visual Studio installation. Subscribe for more videos like this.